Hey everybody, Chris, Four Directions Bushcraft. I just want to show you this tree. This is the mulberry tree. And it's got these heart-shaped leaves that are sawtoothed. They have a satin finish to them. And they are kind of fuzzy on the underneath. Of course you can identify them easily by the berries that they have the white ones are the immature ones and then they turn to red and when they're mature they turn black like blackberries they're edible and they're really really good to eat um, the white ones are kind of sour the black ones are kind of sweet They're really nutritious. Like the blackberry, they're high in vitamin C, high in fiber. At first I confused this for a for a uh, a blackberry bush. But the difference between mulberry and blackberry, the biggest difference. Uh, usually blackberries are bushes obviously but and mulberries can be trees and bushes uh, but a big difference is mulberries don't have thorns and blackberries do have thorns so Native Americans used to use this uh, this plant for many different things just besides the berries um, they drank the root tea uh, for weakness, difficulty urinating, dysentery, tapeworms. Um, obviously they used the fruits for teas, they used them just to eat raw. Um, in modern days now they, they uh, use it for many many different things as well, you know, pastries, cakes, jams obviously. Um, the berries are not really sold commercially too much because they are they go bad really really quickly so blackberries hold up raspberries hold up a little little better than these if you pick these you got to eat them kind of right away Brandon likes mulberries how do they taste Good. yeah are they sweet kind of sour kind of sour which ones do you like best? The black ones. Where are they at? Do you see any? Not too many. See a many. bunch of red ones right there, huh? Yeah. Thanks for your views, comments, and support. And this is the mulberry tree, me and Brandon. We're going to harvest some and eat some today. Yep. Have a good day out there. Have fun.